All right. So these are the various language Wikipedia platforms that is currently working on this project. We have the Arabic Wikipedia, we have the phone Wikipedia, the Ghanaian Pigeon Wikipedia, the Fancy Wikipedia, the Gorone Wikipedia, the Ghana Wikipedia, Chu Wikipedia. Yeah, they have even started. You see that we have some plus symbols here. Then we have the Dagari. Of course, we have our brothers from the Kusal community and the Mori community. We are not able to show that here because they are still in the incubator. But if they were in the mainstream, obviously they would have been listed here. And these symbols will change as and when the articles are created. If we look at the table carefully, we have a plus symbol here where my Keza is. Now this Keza, this plus symbol simply means that currently this article, which is on the English Wikipedia, exists on the tree Wikipedia here. Is this on the uh, 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 um, this one to Rami uh, Ramli? If we also start creating on our various languages, the only change is positive of the items. Now, one easy way: right click on this. If you are using the phone, just tap on it, open on a new tab. Then you have the English Wikipedia. Some of them are pretty much very short, others are very long. And you we obviously have to just translate everything. So this is the article. Now there are two ways of doing translation here. Now, if I want to translate this, the first method is the one we all usually know. I just copy this, the title. I just copy the title, then I go to the uh, Grone Wikipedia. So if it was Dagbani, I would have been going to Dagbani Wikipedia. Now where we have the uh, Wikipedia or search Wikipedia, then I just paste that, the, the title I have copied. And once I click on search, I'm going to find it as a red link if it doesn't exist. If it already exists, it will be a blue link. Because it doesn't exist, I just click on this red link, then I can start doing my translation. Um, let me be quick to mention this. Um, from, from the experience we've had with the previous contest, a lot of us usually come here, I mean, the, on the English Wikipedia, to copy the English text, bring it to the Guruni or whatever language Wiki you are contributing, paste it before you start translating. Please let us all know that it's not a good practice. And um, in instances where we want to award marks, we usually even deduct marks mm -hmm. for people who do that because um, it is assumed that you are trying to cheat up the system. You are trying to get more bytes instead of doing the translation because this is Guruni Wikipedia. Any text that is coming on the Guruni Wikipedia obviously should be Guruni. If it's mm -hmm. on the Daban Wikipedia, it should be Dagbani. If it is on the Kusal incubator, it should be Kusal. If it should be Dagari, it should be Dagari. But a lot of us, we just copy and dump the English text. And now I'll be clicking on edit to be translating small, small. Now, the first text you had brought that gave you so much bytes is equal to zero for no work done. The next translation you do you see that you are now going to be having negative bytes, like though you are going to be increasing in bytes, but if you look at your contribution, you are going to be having negative values. So let me just go to recent changes to um, kind of show what I'm talking about here. And at the end of the day, you find that going against you, you see that you have contributed so much, but then at the end of the day, you are not getting any, or any tangible marks, for instance, Let's say um, Atalata Guma had initially pasted it, an English text that was worth 1,002 bytes. Now, Atalata Guma comes now to translate everything. I'm just using this as an, as an example and for demonstration purpose. She now comes to translate everything now into English. You see that here, instead of getting positive values like these ones, 
she's kind of getting negative values. For even pasting the English text, it's a reduction of your marks because you are bringing a wrong language, uh, like a different language or another language Wikipedia. If it was on the English Wikipedia, that would have even warrant for a block. But because we are still starting up, we don't have strict rules and the rules are very flexible. But what we are encouraging all of us to do is that when you, when you want to translate, kindly copy the text onto maybe WhatsApp or maybe a Word document or whatever you feel you can translate. And when you are done translating, you copy it to the wiki page and now publish. We don't encourage you to also try to publish a whole article. For instance, look at how long this article is and you want to translate everything before you publish. This is a contest. So assuming you are doing this on your WhatsApp or a particular document somewhere, and you want to finish everything before you publish, and another person comes to publish. Sorry to say, you cannot delete what the person has published just to publish your own. That is what we call duplication of effort. You are just trying to duplicate the effort of another person. Now, the articles are many. There are about 200 articles. We would encourage that um, you pick just an article and try to concentrate on it and work on it fully. When you are done, you move to another article. That is one way of translating. The other way of translating uh, the articles is to open the English Wikipedia and at the top, at the top right corner like this, if you are on your phone, you will still find it there. If you are on your laptop, it will still be located here where my cursor is at the moment. Then you click on this drop down arrow. Now, if I click on this drop down arrow, you see that I have this text missing in Farfari, Dagbani, and more. So, all the languages have been contributing that currently, that doesn't have this article currently, is giving me an alert that it doesn't exist in Farfari language or the Grony Wikipedia. It does also exist in Dagbani, in Dagbani Wikipedia and other. Wikipedia platforms. So if I want to add it, let's say on uh, Firefly Wikipedia or the Gurone Wikipedia, I just click on this, then you see the Gurone symbol here or the Firefly, the, if it was Dagbani, I just click on Dagbani. So let me use Gurone Wikipedia. And once I click on Gurone Wikipedia, it loads up a page just like we, those who are past participating on the translate wiki page a project you would have seen something like this and once it opens here i click on tra start translation this is workable on a phone and even on a laptop or computer so uh, whatever device you are using it is still possible um so when once it opens this way i need to be translating based on sections so if i want to translate Let's say this, I just click on this one. This is a table. So this is like an info box. You don't have to translate that. Now I want mm -hmm. to start translating the first paragraph, then I click on this. If I click on this, then I come to this side, add translation. It opens up for me, but this is in English still. So here what I'll do is, the song of the Sibili, blah, blah, blah. So I'll start translating in, in Gruni. And we all know the nuances of the languages. The various languages have got rules. And if you look at the English Wikipedia, sometimes they start a the sentence in a particular way. And when you are doing your translation, you have to do backtrack. Like you have to do inverse translation kind of. So the boy is going to school. Um, let me let me use this one for example. Uh, if you want to do the right translation, you would have been saying sitting down to ask what they are cooking, but this do not make sense to anybody, you know. So you have to read the text, understand it, and now translate it back to the language you want to translate in. So that is uh, that is it for the translation. These are the Wikidata items. And we have up to 200 um, articles. So 
at this point, I would pause here Hello. for questions or additions. Yes. Yeah, please go ahead. Okay. Hello. Good evening to everyone. If it's not coming, then I'll come in. Yeah, hello. Mr. Akakiri, go ahead. Yeah, good evening to everyone. Yeah, evening. Okay. Thank you very much for the presentation. Good evening, Mr. Akakiri. Sorry if you are talking. Yeah. I think we are losing you. Okay. So, I said thank you for the presentation. Mr. Akakiri, I have could something you speak just to add to that about uh, creating the article. Please let us... Uh... Okay. Hello. For the presentation. Uh, my own is a Hello. Group, uh, observation from the previous uh, uh, contest. Uh, Hello. I want to bring it here so that we can correct ourselves going forward. Okay, so maybe you can yeah, use hello. and try... Okay, hello. Can you hear me? Uh, yes, we can hear yeah. you. Hello, we can hear you. Okay, okay. <clears throat> Thank you very much. I said my observation has been drawn from the previous contest, and I want to bring it here so that we can all correct our mistakes going forward. About uh, the so it's like you can really said about uh, waiting to flick it and be working on it and you wait to finish everything and you come to publish and before you come and publish somebody have, might have worked on it halfway so if you publish then it will duplicate but another way is that some they will just create the article just a few sentences and leave it there waiting to finish and come back and continue and if you also leave things like that out of five articles before you come back, you may forget of some of them and you jump over them. So at the end of the day, we just have the article with one sentence or two sentences, and that might not be the best. So at least if you start with an article, try to finish it and finish it well. Though in as much as we wish for the contest, the outcome of the contest, we are also trying to focus on the language quality. The quality matters than the quantity. Yes, we may wish that we want to do and have more articles created. At the end of the day, we'll get the award, but don't forget, our main motive is just to establish or digitize our language. And no one will want to be associated with wrong things or uh, things that are not right. So one day, if somebody is making reference to you that you are the one who said this, something like that, at least no one will be happy to be associated to those things. So in as much as we wish to have the awards, we think of the language first. So make sure that if you create an article and you don't even finish it a day, next time you are coming back to continue, Make sure that you finish it before you move to another one. You may create more than 10 articles and more to create one article and be the winner. And someone who create more, more articles will not win because it depends on the course, or the content. We will create and complete the articles. At the end of the contest, you have to go back and get through some of them. Then it will be cost 90 at the end of the day. Thank you very much. Hello, I'm not the only one who can't see anything again. 
No, you are not the only one. I think uh, it's the network or something like that. My end here, yeah, I can't also hear anything. Nobody is talking. Oh, also asking the same thing. Uh, Linus, Linus, keep quiet. Keep quiet. Then. <laughs> the, host, the host is uh, is out of cavalry area. Linus, keep quiet. Hello, good evening. Hello. Ah, bring it back. It's our host. We have to wait for. Yeah, hello. Yeah, hello. Uh, I, I I think shit of his line has dropped. Um, so yeah. let's wait a while while he comes back. Abba Musa, I am back now. Aha, uh -huh, okay, okay. Yes, um, I think Akakiri was asking a question before the network kicked me out. I'm sure I didn't inform my aunties before joining this meeting. <laughs> okay, so um, what was Akakiri's question, please? So, it was so a, his, about his question was about um, um, the edit. Hello. Yeah, hello. Yeah, hello. Please, you said his question was about the... Uh, he, his issue was about uh, sometimes some people um, kind of creating an article with uh, very little information on that. Then they leave it and then like they create so many of such articles. Mm. And then the issue of about uh, somebody um, trying to um, like he, he tries to translate all of them elsewhere, maybe probably in a Word document or a notepad, then before he comes to publish, somebody has already created that article, but with very little information. So that, that was what he, um, he was talking about. He was advising that when you start an article, try to complete everything before moving to a different article, instead of just creating, creating so many mm -hmm. articles with very scanty information on each of them, yeah, that is very and that you could create fewer articles, but probably going to win or get a position or win the award, but uh, more than the best translators because little information on them. Okay, so um, Avamosa, thank you so much. I think um, the concern raised here is very true. And um, those of us that participated in the last contest would have seen that uh, there were a lot of things that happened. For example, the Mori community, when they couldn't finish all their content, their awards were never released. I think it was released a month or two after Dagbani and Guruni had received their prizes. So if you actually want to win a prize, the prizes uh, for this contest are in three categories. We have $100 for the person, the first uh, the best contributor, we have $70 for the second best contributor, then we have $50 for the third top contributor. So we, we are all striving to get these three categories. But then if you create skeletal articles, it might not work. So we'll do our look at judgment, but the final judgment lies in the hands of the uh, Wiki World Heritage User Group, especially Yamin. And for Yamin, they use four tracking tools. They use uh, what we call the hashtag tool. They also use the outreach dashboard. They use um, <laughs> Wiki Query to also run Query for bytes. And they use a, t a fourth tool to check edits. So even if we I judge you the best winner and at the end of the day, they come out with their winners, perhaps this might be true because they are going to use 
other sophisticated tools that we might not use. So let's all try to do diligent work. And uh, at the end of the day, uh, when it's time, when it's time for them to review or when it's time for us to review the work, it will be pretty much easier for all of us. Yeah, Felicia, I see your hand up. Okay, thank you very much for the chance. I my, my network wasn't good. I don't know if you have already said something about it or not. I just want to ask if we are only going to be looking at edit counts only. I don't know about other uh, uh, communities, but our community, when I, I'm going through the articles, you read some and there's no meaning. But the person has a large edit, team, edit count. So this person will go and win and then the work will be there. Somebody will open it, the person won't be able to read. The written is like, ah, is this person translating or what is this person even trying to say? For you to edit, you have to go back to the English version to now go and read to see what this article is about. Then you come back and edit it. So I was thinking that if we, we could change it a different way, rather than looking at only edit counts, we should look at the quality of the work before we award we this thing. If you have 1,000 edit counts and then another person has five, but your own work, there's no meaning. But the one who has only five points has a meaning. You can give it to that person. That is what I was, I wanted to add up. So that it, it will, the work could be more quality than just winning awards and winning awards without we knowing what we are doing there. Uh-huh. Sorry for my listening, <laughs> my voice. But I, I, I'm just, sometimes when I go inside to edit, I become angry. What is this person trying to say? So if a person just came for the award, that what we want to be there is not there. Uh-huh. So <laughs> that's what I want to just say. If we could do it that way. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much for sharing that, Felicia. Um, I think for the uh, for the quality of work, I think the judgment will be done at the various language wikis level. So, for example, uh, Guruni will have our own way of judging the best winner, even apart from the metrics. And uh, Dagbani and other communities, we, we are, at the end of the day, we want the content translated, all references added, and all the necessary information added. But when it comes to judging the articles, quality of work, edit count, number of bytes, that one will be decided at the local level, especially those who know the nuances of the language. I think um, this is quite, a whole lot of work for the Gruner community where people come to just edit. And at the end of the day, you have to reinvent the whole wheel, especially even references. They come to add the English Wikipedia references straight, like referencing the English Wikipedia, instead of referencing the source that was sourced. And in such cases, trust me, you get zero points for that because at the end of the day, the jury would have to spend maybe another month trying to correct it. That thing happened during the seventh parliament. Most of the references that were added were from, were referencing English Wikipedia instead of the source that was source. They were rather referencing English Wikipedia as a source. Meanwhile, it's also a language wiki, just like the Guruni wiki or Kusa wiki or the mm -hmm. wiki. So yes, we'll look at quality of work, we'll look at edit counts and we'll look at bytes. That's why we are not going to use one tool. I've just kept a hashtag in the chat. Um, the hashtag is WWH2023. WWH2023 is the hashtag we'll be using for the hashtag tool. Uh, we'll use outreach dashboard to monitor number of bytes and number of Hello, edits. You know. we'll use Sorry. Uh, hello. Yeah, sorry, sorry to cut you. Can I be heard? Is someone asking? Uh-huh. Just to add to yes, what please, you said you can about, be heard. Uh, about uh, Felicia's uh, concern. No? I think it's a very genuine concern. And um, it's, it's probably because most of us are, are, are still not um, uh, coming to terms with the reason why we are doing these projects. 
um, if you have it at the back of your mind that we want to take advantage of this platform that Wikimedia is providing us to promote our various languages, um, you should be sincere to yourself, be honest to yourself, so that whatever we are putting on that platform should be quality one. Hey, I always say that um, you should be thinking of one day, like this thing is going to be here forever. So someday when it is becoming, it becomes more useful to society, wherever you are at your old age or, in your, or even your grave, you can knock, knock your chest and then feel proud that you took part in contributing to the success of this thing. So if you are limiting your, 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 your focus to just contest and then just winning prizes, and then you are just dumping things there just because to accumulate edit counts and then to win prizes. I think we should be sincere to ourselves. We should be honest to ourselves. Sometimes you, you see um, the founders of this um, platform, they are giving us this opportunity to do this. Sometimes you ask you, ah, do they understand Guruni? Huh. If they don't understand Guruni and they are giving you this opportunity, you don't deceive them by putting just anything there and then take prizes. So first of all, our appeal, our appeal to us to be honest and sincere to ourselves and do genuine and quality work so that put posterity will, will, will judge us one day. Let's not limit our, our, our attention to just prizes, prizes and all that. Of course, it is important because we are spending our time and we are data to do these things, but we should be looking at the bigger picture, which is the future. Uh -huh. Now, if after the, the articles have been created, uh, assuming sometimes, um, especially the Dagbani community, mostly it is not one person who edits the whole thing in, the, in an article. So if you are, we have so many chap, or like Felicia said, you are reading so many things and they don't make sense. Who is going to take that pain, that time, to go through the whole, to look at the number of articles that we have? So I'll just appeal to ourselves, whatever you are doing on this platform, just appeal to your own conscience and then do the right thing. Uh -huh. So that's what I want to add for now. I see uh, Fadila's hand up. I've almost got God bless you for saying this. We are very grateful. Yakub Fadila Kasi. My okay. Um, good buy. evening. My my point has been uh, uh, said already by um, Mr. Musa, so I won't say anything again. All right. Thank you so much. Um, we have Tunsung. Mr. Zakaria Tunsung, please, you are next. Yeah. Uh, um, please, um, what I just want to find out is um, many times we have contests, they always give female contributors uh, maybe some kind of uh, chance or incentive like by providing for female contributor but this one um, is it also like that or it's different um yeah so usually we give that opportunity to provide a, a, like an equal playing ground for everyone however this is a contest we are collaborating with another community so we unfortunately don't have that offer. We only have offers for the first three top contributors. Um, and we are, we are all acquainted with the saying that what men can do, women can do it better. And I know our women are very capable, especially for the growing community. We have the women carrying almost all the day. So we are challenging all our women to to become the master craft of the communities. Thank you so much for raising this tune soon. But we'll, we'll try to um, see in future contests if we could have special packages for our women folk. I think it's, it's an important thing. But then um, the initial distance was for just two communities and we managed to get it for five communities. I know budget is an issue everywhere. So they had to squeeze out budget just to make sure the five communities participate in this contest. But hopefully in future, we can think about that. Thank you so much for raising this.
Please, do we have any other concern or question? Yes, yeah. uh, let Hello. me come in. Oh, uh, I, I want to ask, uh, so now, uh, are they starting immediately after this call or when are they to start? Thank you so much for asking. Yeah, the, the, the start of the contest is just after this call. Um, so we could even see from 8 p.m. tonight to 31st, uh, 11.59 p.m. on 31st December. That's what we'll be tracking. But for the user group, okay. they are very much particular about completion of an article. Especially when it's translation. Okay, but I think the movie happening. community knows it, knows this thing better. Abba Musa, please go ahead. But the lesson is up to the game. Please, okay, okay please and then. Yes. I don't, I don't know whether you can still show me like uh, how to open the two tabs at the same time. I wasn't, uh, I didn't see how you. I was did saying it, that so hand is up again. Maybe she wants to say something. Oh, okay. Hello. Yes, you want me to show you how to open the two tabs? The two tabs at the same time. Yes. The English and the... The English and then the Dagban. Okay. Um, currently, I'm joining on my phone because of the network. But okay. if you open just the English Wikipedia article, okay. at the top, you find... Uh, the number of languages that article is written in. So if it is in two two languages, you will find mm -hmm. two languages. If it is three, three languages. And if you tap on that one, you can click on translate to a particular language and just choose your language mm -hmm. and you okay. are good to go. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah. You're welcome. But I'll be on standby on WhatsApp if you have further questions. Yeah, hello, Dian. Yeah, Dian. Yes, please. Uh, yeah, the show clarify as they made the top mail contribute. I want to find out whether this time around there will be data allowance for other members or only we focus only the three uh, participants. Only the whether three participants. For... Okay. Yes, only the three participants. And it's going to be in. Um, uh, gift vouchers because usually like last year's own they, they purchased the Malcolm vouchers online at Morocco and uh, there was a date that was fixed for us to go for the vouchers and we went and picked it up and now distributed to the winners and the same thing is going to happen now we pleaded that they should make it cash but it is not Wikimedia friendly. Wikimedia abscons upon us giving fiscal cash for editing. So they will not be able to give fiscal cash. Any other concern? Okay, okay. for Dila. So, so let me add this. Yeah, let me add this. No, okay, I found that. I think. Uh huh. So regarding the, 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 the prizes, now since it is an external uh, user group that is organizing it, um, I think less participants be reminded that the, the prizes in the form of gift vouchers you mentioned do not usually come as uh, quickly as possible after the contest as we've been doing it at um, our local level here to let um, participants and of course uh, the prospective winners be reminded that um, they should have patience um, with the organizers, uh, especially the local organizers here, when the contest is over and then the, the prizes are not yet forthcoming. Um, we, we have very little control over those things since we are not the ones organizing it. So I just want to remind the participants and then the, those who will be lucky to win prizes. I, I I really support your point here, even hundred plus one. <laughs> it's hundred plus. Zero, so thank you so be... much for raising this. Yeah, I think last year, month, year sometimes it can take last year it, it took more than. 
a man uh -huh. before we receive them. Mm -hmm. So, yes. Been a man. Okay, she told you, about you were demonstrating um, like you were. Before... Um, Hello. Hello. Yeah, hello, Sito. Yes, so I promise I think you can. Yeah, it, it's like you were, you were, um, yeah, I was just reiterating um, the fact it's that like you were demonstrating year, on the last year price uh, delayed and um we we had to wait for a month or two before we received the awards yeah yes and some people started talking them um, harshly regarding that so that's why i thought it was to remind us Okay, so um, Afamus, I think you can move the motion for the launch of the contest so that we can. Um, but before then, it's like you were demonstrating something when the um, Padilla or so, some or so came in about the hashtag, no? adding the hashtag as and when you edit. Yes, yes, yes. So anytime you, add, you finish editing and you want to write your edit summary, please try to add the hashtag. So uh, w uh, hashtag World Heritage. Uh, where, where, let me write it again in the chat for everyone. I think I think, I think you should. You, yeah, uh, if you can, uh, you it share it in the WhatsApp groups. Mm -hmm. so yeah, we, we share it in the WhatsApp platform. Mm -hmm. So if you are right, if you are going to publish your edit summary. Uh -huh. Let's hear. I've okay. added so you are adding it up. inside the edit summary, right? Yes, edit summary, not the article. I think last year we saw that some people were adding it inside the article. No, it's when, like, uh, Dagbani, Lahabajia, Guruni, uh, Laksogo, uh, Laksogo, then you put uh, this text there and now add what you have done. So if you have added more content, then we just put this hashtag and give space and say added more content in that order. And also the category we'll be using to track it will just be uh, WWH. Yeah, I suggest if you can just write all those things so that we'll put it onto the WhatsApp platform for members to see. Sorry? I'm saying that if you can write the categories as well as the hashtags so that members will put it onto our WhatsApp platform. Because some of, some of them may not get what you are saying. But if it is ah, okay. So we should just post it on our WhatsApp platforms, right? <laughs> Yes, yeah, I think that's that. That's okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Mm. So the category will be WWH intangible. Please, that should be added to every article we have created because this is one of the things we'll be using to track that. So I found at this junction G times C, after having dotted all the I's and tied the T's. Uh, if we don't have any further question. You can move a motion for the lunch, then we can get to work. Hello? Yes, you are audible. Anybody? Okay, okay. So uh, before I do that, uh, let me just uh, read that um, participants or editors should not be well. about the uh, choosing the, the winners. Uh, this one is organized by the, an external body, uh, user group. And like Shito mentioned, they are using four different modalities. So you should not be worried about whether it will be judged based on characters or edit counts. 
it's like I saw somebody mention, why don't we follow the edit counts um, uh, method or the rule? So let's just ensure that we do quality work, something that somebody will point to us someday and we're proud of it. Uh -huh. Sometimes you, you see that some people are not contributing on their platforms, but they are quick to point, like to point out the mistakes that the errors that we are churning out there. So let's be mindful of this and then just make sure that we do quality work. Uh -huh. And you will be, you'll be rewarded accordingly if you really deserve it. Um, some people are still raising their hands or in the chats. Okay, so I think that's, that's, that's just about it. So on this note, on behalf of the executive director, the project manager, and then the local organizer for this particular um, contest, I, I declare the, um, uh, this contest duly started. And right from here, uh, participants are free to start editing and all the best to everybody. I wish everybody all the best of luck. Uh, thank you, Shitabu. Thank you so much. Uh, anyone to second or object? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, Akakiri, duly second that the project is duly launched. Thank you so much. And um, if you have any question, please, you know where to find us. We are available on the WhatsApp platforms. You can also slip into our DMs and uh, we'll be able to answer all your queries. Thank you so much for making the time to be part of today's meeting.